Hello friends, hope you all are doing great. Welcome to today's session of Microsoft Office 365 on Photon Academy. In today's video, I will show you on how you can create a public or private plan in Microsoft Office 365 planner. So let's head to the planner. Why wait here? So planner is part of the Office 365 suite. So and is available on the portal easily. You can access the planner from the tab here. Once you click on that, you will be landing on the planner hub. So planner hub contains all current plans that are going on inside your organization or which are in association. Let's head on to how to create a new plan with a private or so let me show you how you can create a public or a private plan. So friends, let's move on to the tab where a option to create new plan is available. Click on that. The new plan the pop up will come up, which will ask you for a plan name for less example for let's take it to be a testing. Testing one plan. Let us make this a private plan. So here is the option that I meant to show you for marking your plan as either a private plan or a public plan. So the public plan ha has access to all the people inside your organization. So everyone in the organization can access your public plan. Secondly, the private plan. So all the only the members who is added to the particular plan can only see the activities or the contents of the private plan. So in this way, you can bifurcate your plan and you can create by clicking on here. So I hope this has been a important feature which would be very much useful to you on creating different varieties of plans for your organization as per their requirement. To get to know more tips and features on Office 365, head on to our Fortron Academy on YouTube. Have a great day.